what is up, Tube? Let's get into this. It's Friday. So what is up, Tube? Welcome back. Today is Friday. Oh, I got an itch. Oh, you really got an itch and you just got a sense for you. Today is Friday, guys. I'm headed to work. Not as busy, not as booked as I was yesterday. I'm gonna I always keep it real with you guys. You know me, I don't pull punches. I tell you guys how it is, how it's gonna be. Today is Friday. We are struggling at our shop. Struggling. And by struggling, I mean by the amount of work that's coming into my shop. Um, you know, compared to, uh, say, two years ago, even last year. Last year, I thought we were hurting, but we're hurting way more this year. Um, the only difference is that I'm doing the majority of the work. Since I'm the owner, of course, a lot of the money's coming to me. So I'm able to make the bills. I'm able to make all the payments. I'm able to to, to stay, up, stay afloat. But... That's to take away from the fact that the shop itself is is slow. You know, for the amount of haircuts that we used to do, say, a year ago to this time, is a big difference. So, um, you know, it is what it is, guys. I ain't going to trip on it right now. We are in the middle of a global pandemic. If you guys don't know about that, we are in the global pandemic. So, yes, there's a, a um, you know, society, everything is is uh screwed up right now so you know right now like i've said it over and over it's come out of my mouth guys you've heard it many times you know right now it's all about survival it's about survival it's about getting through this year and then next year we'll continue to rebuild and get back to it you know what i mean but for now my guys this is what it's this is what it's about so um i'm headed to the shop right now i'll get started on this day i'm gonna try 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 hard to uh film my haircut to some more today and I, I i still haven't done one yet in a couple of days so um we'll see what we can get into guys hope you guys are up you know the spill already it's friday it's grind day grind friday is definitely a grind day you need to be at work on fridays all right ladies and gentlemen we'll see you guys in a little bit
seen businesses go out of business like that, you know? Because those are all mom and pop shops, you know? Places like this, it's like, it's like my barber shop, you know? We're just one stop location, you know? We're not a big, giant corporation or nothing like that. And um, this pandemic has killed a lot of businesses, you know? Um, I played it. I played it different the second time around, so I, I helped myself out and without, um, so I wouldn't miss out. But it, it's horrible. It's horrible. It's horrible what businesses have gone through, and um, they've lost out a lot of money. And it's tough out there right now. It's super tough. A lot of people uh, are out of work. A lot of people are losing their businesses. They're losing their income. You know, and it's it's just tough. It sucks. But uh, you know, only the strong is gonna survive. And you gotta, you gotta do what you gotta do to survive it, guys. That's the whole thing, you know. That's that's. It depends on what you're willing to do to put yourself out there and what you're willing to do to, to survive, you know. Like sometimes you gotta go against the law and do what you gotta do, you know. Like I've told you guys from the beginning, guys, this year 2020 is about survival. And today at the barber shop, we are surviving. It's been slow, guys. I'm not gonna lie. Um, the boys probably got a couple cuts each. Uh, Dave hasn't got a cut yet. It's already 11 o'clock um, Dave's in the bottom of a low totem pole. So it's kind of sucks. It's, we gotta wait for walk-ins and just it just ah, man it, it kills me. It seems like like Well, there's no walk-ins coming in, you know, there's no walk-ins I, I got a Google ad on Google and you know, usually I get calls from there But I haven't even got any calls from there and I'm spending like 200 bucks a month on them and I feel like I'm just getting burned by them. I feel like it's it's a waste of money, you know, because it really hasn't been been busy at all, as far as walk-in clients coming in for the guys that don't have appointments, you know. So it sucks for them, but uh, you know what, guys? That's what this barber business is about. You know, you gotta get, you know, you gotta survive it. You gotta promote yourself. You gotta put yourself out there. You can't just sit around and wait for people to come to you to get haircuts. Sometimes you gotta go out there and get yourself clients motivate yourself to uh to promote yourself and put ads up and and talk to people and hand out business cards you know because uh in the end you gotta you gotta you gotta make this if, if you're gonna make it you gotta make it for yourself your, your shop owner's not gonna do it for you the shop owner's the shop owner you know like myself i'm the busiest guy at my shop but you know i've been there 11 years you know Everybody knows me. Everybody's been there for me, you know. So a lot of people, even today, they call and they want a haircut by me, and I'll tell them, well, if you want a haircut by me, then you got to book an appointment because I'm not taking any walk-ins. The walk, we're taking walk-ins, but the walk-ins are going with the guys, you know. And I, um, even if I have a spot available, I won't really take a walk-in. If a walk-in just walks in, I'm gonna send them to the boys because they they need to work too, you know. So. We're at that point right now at the shop, so we're we're we're, we're moving though. We're 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 grinding. That's what it's all about, guys. You know what? You can't sh you can't win if you don't show up. If you stay home, you're not gonna win shit. Straight up. It's my tip for the day. Nah, we're gonna do some tips and tricks later, but that's a good tip, guys. If you gotta show up, you know, if you don't show up, you can't win. You know, if you're at home, you're not gonna win nothing. You're not gonna do nothing at home. So think about that. Um, I'm gonna go head back to the shop, finish off this day strong. Right now it's only 11.30. Um, I um, just came out to get some lunch. I had a spot in between my, my uh, schedule. Right now, so far, I've probably done about, probably about, done about six haircuts. Uh, it hasn't been, like I said, it has some spots in between. It wasn't like I was super busy. But uh, it is what it is, and we're here, and we're working. See you guys in a while. All right, my barbers and barberettes, that's it. Day is over. This Friday is over. Uh, you know what? It turned out to be an okay day. Now, yes, I'm not as busy as I was uh, yesterday, but the uh, uh, number one and number two barbers, they were pretty busy. Raul was as busy as I was. So uh, that turned out to be a good day. Dave, Dave's still, Dave's grinding. Dave's here, he's grinding, he's standing, he's watching, he's, you know what I mean? And when he gets his chance, he's knocking the car, he's knocking those haircuts out of the ballpark. I'm proud of that boy. He's doing really, really good. So guys, you know what? We're just moving along right here. We're just doing our thing, uh, uh, just making it work, making it work. Not too crazy of a day, of course. Guys, I'm seriously, it's like we're at 50% of what we were maybe last year. I was thinking about it too. Last Friday, last year at this time on uh, on Fridays, we were booming with with uh, uh, 
with business but you know what guys this is a crazy ass year we just got to get past this year i have already told you guys if i told you once i told you twice i told you a million times we just have to keep grinding keep grinding guys that's your tip for the day your tip for the day is never give up never give up no matter what no matter if you're the guy in the corner in the last chair and you only got three cuts for the day you know what keep that smile on your face Greet everybody, talk to everybody, make sure you say goodbye and thank you. Thank them like you cut their hair. Think about that. You thank them for coming into the shop like you cut their hair. And guess what? They're gonna remember that. They're gonna remember that you're being that, that you know what? That you're a good guy, you're a good person, and they're gonna talk to you. Next time they're gonna come in, they're gonna talk to you like like they came to get a haircut from you. And then eventually, one day, when that guy doesn't show up and they need a backup, guess who they're gonna go to? They're gonna go to you. That's your tip for the day. Always keep a smile on your face. Always keep a positive attitude. And you know what? The clients will gravitate to you. I feel that's why they gravitate to me. Not only because I've been here 11 years. Yeah, I've been here for a long time and people know me already. They know how I work. They know what I do, you know? And, and that, I think they grab that and my, my positive attitude just grab it. They gravitate to me. I think they, that's how it is. But that's the way you got to be, guys. That's what you got to do. That's what you got to do to succeed in this business. You got to have a good attitude. You know what? Like I've told you a million times, a haircut, haircut is only part of the service. A haircut, yeah, it's important to do a good haircut. But there's so much more involved in getting them back. Getting them back to your company, getting them, get them to come back into your chair. You know, it's all about customer retention, guys. It's about retaining those clients, getting them on your book, getting them to get on your book and start booking regularly. You know, I've been noticing these new clients that they've been popping up like the third week in a row, and I'm like, oh, all right, cool. And I'm starting to learn their names now, and they've been booking. And I'm never, they, they found me. I didn't find them, they found me. And now we're starting to build a little relationship, and that's how it is in this business. And that's the way you guys gotta be. All right, guys, that's your tip for the day, guys. I hope you guys had a good day today. I hope you guys are grinding. I hope you guys are out there doing your thing. Remember, guys, if you're at home, you're not winning. You know what I mean? You got to be, you got to play in order to get paid. You know what I mean? You got to be out there. You got to be grinding. If you're not grinding, if you're not at work, you're not going to make anything. You know what I mean? And if you're the glass guy on the tonal pole, keep your head up, keep showing up, and I guarantee you, one day, you're going to be one of those guys on top. I guarantee you that. All right, guys, with that being said, you guys have a blessed night, and I'll see you guys mañana. Grind on.